here we are testing the um, uh, JavaFX application in an, uh, my Android device, which is a Nexus 4, which uh, might be considered a low-end device. Let's start the application. The application is about takes about six seconds to to start, which isn't that bad. Not not that fast either, but not bad. Here we have a login screen. can see that it, bring, it brings up the 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 keyboard the 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 android keyboard once you select a text field or a password field here is a simple binding example where you enter your birth date and the birth date value is bound to a string which uh, which is in the, is uh, above the text field and enter here uh, the birth date and the bound string which is above the text field tells you you were born in the given date just a simple example of binding here you, know, you have a listener example where you you add a listener to do uh, an observable list then you you add values to that list uh, random values you can add random values to that list in random positions the text above tells you uh, which random position was replaced with uh, a random number it's a simple example of, of listeners li uh, observable list listeners here's an example of a, of a service service running background service It's retrieving data in a background thread. Then it populates a, a table. Here you have an example of a task, an asynchronous task that populates a table. You can see that this examples run f pretty pretty well and uh, responsive they, they run responsively and uh, and fast and fast enough um, here you have an uh, example of a of multi touch where you can see uh, you can touch the, these images and uh, resize them with pinch with a pinch uh, gesture uh, this example doesn't run all that well it may be because of of the of programming of the, of the this the it, it might be a fault of the uh, a programming fault not and not a performance issue you can see it's it's uh, it's more or less responsive it takes a while to to track the finger this is the only example that uh doesn't run uh, uh 
I'd say top notch. Doesn't have a top notch uh, responsiveness, but uh, still runs well. There's a gestures example. Here's uh, some charts. You have an area chart. You can see the they render well. Scatter chart. Line chart. Pie chart. It all runs pretty well. Bar chart. You have some more examples of controls, table view, table cell, tree table, text field, progress bar, you, you can see the progress bar, friends well. Progress indicators run pretty well. Here you have a uh, list with some scrolling. You can see that they scroll pretty fast. They're very, very responsive. Very responsive to scrolling with the thing with the swipe gest gesture. Here you have a, pa a pagination example. You can see it runs very fast, pretty fast. You have a, a dialogues example. Dialogues aren't really working on Android. You can see you create uh, here you, uh, an alert. It's not showing, displaying very well. Exception dialog. It's not. They're not really. This is a new text input dialog. Not showing that well. Here we have some layout examples, just some simple layout examples. Uh, now to the, to the animation part. Here you have some simple animations with an interpolator. You can see that, that this runs well. No performance issues. Rotate transition runs very performant. It's very performant. Performant. Scale transition. Parallel transition, which are two transitions that happening at the same time. You can see this runs very well. Stroke animation, changing the color of the stroke, animated. Field transition, this all runs well, very well. Pass transition, an object moving along a given path. Animating along a given path, it runs very performant. It's very performant. Sequential transition, transition that happens. It happens one after the other. You can see it runs very well. Now, uh, pause transition. transition you 
timeline, just uh, an example of a, of a ball moving along it, uh, with an animation given by a timeline. Here's some graphics to the examples, stopwatch, you can start the stopwatch pressing the green button, here it, you can see it's running very, the performance is very good, it's very responsive, here are bouncing balls, click the balls and they bounce, with some with some uh, with a reflection uh, reflection effect it runs pretty well the speed gauge Speed gauge. Some examples of of graphics to the line, right angle, an arc, path, circle, inner shadow, reflection, some effects in the shadow reflection effect Gaussian blur the sepia tone and that's it you can see this runs very performant uh, there are some examples uh, dialogues th that don't work that well, like dialogues aren't working. Um, the the example with the images where you we, you could rotate the images uh, and uh, drag the images, it wasn't running at a hundred percent, but it was pretty good. It might be a a, a programming issue, not and not something to do with JavaFX itself. Uh, you can see that uh, this is running pretty well with good performance in a low-end device, which is my Nexus. This is a Nexus 4. And that's it.